Previously on Piccolo's Cage, the memeverse is invaded by cyber memes. The sky is on fire, which is somehow stopping the bathtub from doing anything helpful to the plot. The 7 Eleven is also on fire. Piccolo's Cage joins up all his friends and builds an army to cut off Lord Dyson's ass. I will cut off your ass. We are the culmination of every single dead meme ever posted on Reddit, Tumblr, and Instagram. Big Daddy threatens to kill Piccolo's friends. Piccolo's Cage says no. I said no. Find out what happens next on Piccolo's Cage. How scary. Come on, let's run. Oh no, my leg! Oh no, my other leg! Oh, I'm falling over! Oh god! Damn it, this happens in like every single horror film. They fall over for literally no reason. Help me, man! I'm gonna die! You know, in fact, don't help me, just keep going. I'll only slow you down. No shit. Oh! And now I am dying! Oh! I am. I am here and I am. am dying! Ah! Look at me die! I am dying! Dying. More like not dying. <laughs> Who the hell are you? That, that does not matter now, Maisie Skip. I am here to bring you alive. What? 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 Come on, get up! We're, we're going, we're going away from here. Somewhere else, which is better. But I am dying, and my leg is, is, ow, is in pain. Ah, it doesn't matter, I've lost a few legs in my life. I'll remove yours too, and we can get out of here with immense haste. Do not worry, I will help you. By removing my legs? Yes. Now, come on, take one of my hands. away from the person I've just shot, so when I look back and realize they're not there, I'm gonna be immensely surprised. Oh my god, they're not there! Hello, I am right behind you. What in the hell? How did you get back there? Oh, oh god, my arm! Oh no! It seems, if you want something done right, you do it yourself. Big Daddy, I, myself, will put an end to your reign of terror. Now that's high praise. What are you doing? Hello there, Peter. I'm simply fixing the bathtub with my repairing machete. Would you care for a piece of birthday cake and a Winchester rifle? That's Stacy's gun, isn't it? Yeah, it was one of the last things I could get out of the 7-Eleven before it burned down. Anyway, why have you come here? Oh, well, Obama has uh, instructed me specifically to go and find you because the, me the council is about to have a meeting. Ah, I see. I shall be there imminently, but we will both go at the same time. Calculation nearly complete. My fellow Americans, the uh, the cyber memes are beating us everywhere uh, on all our active battlefronts, and uh, we are losing. They've uh, only recently conquered uh, the Obamas. Damn! Do all these people look alike or what? The cyber memes will not stop until they have conquered. 
everything they can until until there's nothing left to conquer. They will capture every single living thing and turn it into another cyber meme. Meaning, you know, our enemy is ever growing. What about the droid attack on the Wookiees? I also am curious about that. And what of PewDiePie? Many of the council uh, cannot make it as they are preoccupied by the invasion. That joke would have been like infinity times more funnier if this actual episode came out when he was still on his month break, but uh, just pretend that he still is and laugh. The dark side surrounds the cyber memes. Big Daddy is in charge of the cyber memes. If we can get to him, we can stop them. I sense there is more to this Big Daddy than meets the eye. It would really help if we knew who he was. Piccolos? <laughs> I have no idea who the hell Big Daddy is. Do you, Peter? No idea. Well, uh, uh I see that the humongous father, uh, also known as Big Daddy, uh, is the main cause of this invasion. Shut up, moron. That's clearly wrong. Oh, okay. Fuck you! Sorry, folks. The Bible backs me up on this one. Fuck you! Fuck you. Fuck you! Sounds reasonable. Uh, do you have uh, any idea? Uh, what we can do uh, to find him. Well, Obama, I have a suggestion. While I was while I was repairing the bathtub earlier, I realized that the bathtub was in fact tracking another bathtub. Now I usually I didn't even know this was a feature until I realized more bathtub time machines started popping into the plot like they've just always been there. Uh, but yeah, we we're using that to track where it's coming from, and I assume. Wherever that is, Big Daddy will also be. Mmm, smells like chicken. So that's the plan. We just head over there and kill Big Daddy. It's probably gonna be a bit more complex than that, but yeah. I'm sure the General has some fantastical tactics that we, he can use to help us. Right, General? What the fuck is he doing? Can we address the fact that the baby Yoda is in the exact same room as us? You are quite right there, Peepa Banana. We did in fact make a 150 billion dollar deal with Disney. So, and they were like, oh, but you, uh, oh, oh, you have to show baby Yoda in the next episode, sir. So I was like, oh, okay, sure, sure. Wasn't Tommy was all supposed to show up? Of course I'm here now, just what I call this biggest fish in the lake. Huh. I hope you all are happy with yourselves. Mmm. I'll eat it. Tommy, you're late, but I am quite proud of you for catching the most biggest, most humongous, most gigantinormous, throbbing, pulsating fish. So well done. Uh, the council has decided, uh, we shall travel to the volcano, uh, where, uh, literally all the bad guys are, uh, we shall kick some ass. Uh, uh, how could you? How could you? God damn it! what are you doing? Oh, I, I thought you said we couldn't. Never mind, never mind. If we're gone, we're gone. That's good, that's good, that's good. Let's get the hell out of here. This is gonna be sweet. Isaac, you think you could use your handsome face to stop my plan and kill me? Well, yes, of course. You see through me like a transparent material. The only reason I'm keeping you guys alive so that I can lure Pickles Cage here. However, sadly, I'm going to have to kill you myself. By killing you. Till you're dead. Uh, uh, I know who you are. Joe, what the hell are you doing? I'd like you uh, to say what you just said again. Go on. Do it. Oh, Joe. You'd give up your own life to save a cool epic Isaac? My name's Joe. Uh, kick ass. Wicker man. Gone in 60 seconds. No. Joe is dead. 
I think our hostages should be punished for their little insurgency. What do you suggest? Oh, I say we'll lock them up. Oh no, you're gonna lock us up? No, please don't do that. I don't like being locked up. You're going away for a super uber long time. You go boss, man. You don't look very intimidating when you're out of your ominous chair. You look just kind of like a guy. Do you think Isaac's okay? Well, it was interpreted from the video that we previously watched in the last episode that Isaac was shot in the face. However, Isaac is one of the, the favorite characters, in my personal opinion. So, I think he's fine. The frightening thing is, whatever we do today, we'll either end this once and for all, or make things a thousand million times worse. Well, neither of those things could happen. We could end up going to the wrong place, you know, get the wrong address by accident. That is actually an option to consider, Peter. You know what? This whole episode might just be a fluke. We might just end up going to the wrong place. But you know, only time will tell. Funny to think we threw an old man to his death from this exact same bridge. Wonder how he's getting along. Mm, walking, I am. Piglet's cage arrived, I have. Ah, holy shit, Master Yoda! Ah! Holy shit, Master Yoda! How you doing? You actually hear and this isn't this isn't a force scap or some sort of weird hallucinogenic drug. Trained you well, I have Piglet's. Do this, you can. Can I just can I just check one thing? Oh. You feel so real. It's like you're really here. But you are really here, so it's all real. Get off me, you must! Right, I've fallen down in that hole twice now. I think I'm getting kind of sick of it. Coming to an end, things are. Be prepared, you must. But Master Yoda, I I'm worried. What if I can't do it? What if I can't beat Big Daddy? What if I try and cannot? Strong and wise you are. Master Yoda, I still think you should pantan that shit. You know, maybe curl it as well. Your hair could do with some, uh, volume and laugh. How old are you? Like 900 and something? You're still looking good, obviously, but like I'm saying, uh, if you, if you died it, you, you'd get, like, all of the women.